that. We're back to our little um, board here. This was the one I thrifted for $1.99. It has the hanger in the back. To start with, I was gonna make a little, a small tray out of this or a riser, put a little feet on. But I decided to just leave it as a hanger and put this cute transfer on it. I'm just loving the sheep theme right now. Um, I'm kind of making a category of sheep and all the farm animals. So I'm going to keep it as a hanger and just apply this transfer on. I, all I did, I'll show a before picture either in the video or in the comments um, and you guys will remember this um, piece, but it was like a, a picture of a bathtub or something you would hang in a bathroom. But, oh yeah, so I just went over it with my plaster Waverly chalk paint. And I think I did, a, I ended up doing a couple of coats. And then I went and I just um, mixed, it was weird. It was just how I had some paints in a plate and they ended up mixing. It was a little bit of the ink, which is a black tone and the plaster. And it ended up mixing just a little bit and so it made a really light gray and I just went and distressed over this and I did around the edges as well. And I think I'm going to take my 220 grit sandpaper and just lightly sand around the edges and just distress it real slightly where some of the wood will pop back through and give it that pretty distressed look. So let's go ahead and get this transfer applied. And there it is. That is so cute. And I decided I'm gonna go at the top and add fresh lamb meat up here at the top. So I'm gonna do that really quick. Then I'm gonna take my 220 grit sandpaper, sand and distress around the edges, and this piece will be completed. Okay, and here's our finished product. I went and just distressed it with some of my sandpaper. And gave it that distressed edge and I added the other transfer on the top. I love it. Let me know what you think.